Hey guys, so let's go ahead and jump into this video. Today I'm going to start out with showing you how to do, I'm going to do my eyebrows. I'm starting out with the Benefit Give Me Brow. Um, I really like this product. This one is in the shade 3. Um, I believe they only have three shades and this is in the darkest shade, which I'm using right now. Then I'm going in with just a brush. Then I'm going to start out with our palette today. This is the Studio Makeup On The Go palette. This is the Cool Tones. Um, this is the one I recently received in my BoxyCharm. Um, and I'm going to start with that shade that you saw there. There's no names for these, so it does make it a little difficult. But I'm going to be applying that with a crease brush. Um, and I'm just going to be applying that directly in my crease area and blending that up a little bit into my upper crease. It's going to be our transition shade. Then I'm going to take that dark shade there and be using our crown crease brush that we also got in the Boxy Charm and applying that shade directly into our crease area. Then I'm going to be taking that shade there. Um, this shade does have some shimmer to it. And I'm going to be taking just a lid brush and applying that directly onto our lid. Nothing too intense today, just keeping it kind of more on the natural, natural side. Then here I'm going in with a clean crease brush and just blending those shades together. Then I'm going back in with those two shades that we used in our crease area and applying those to the bottom lash line. I'll be using the lightest color shade um, and then taking the darkest color and applying that more to the outer corner of the eye. Then I'm going in with the color we used on the lid and applying that in our inner corner just for a little bit of a highlight. Then here I'm going in with a black eyeliner and this is by the brand Hikari and I'm going to be applying this in our waterline. And sorry for the mirror, but I couldn't hold it and apply that at the same time, so it is a little bit in the way. Then I'm going to go in with the same eyeliner and apply that to my top lash line. Um, I'm going to do a tight line with that and then just apply a very small line that you could also see as well. Then I'm going in with my Benefit Roller Lash Mascara and I'm going to apply this to the top and bottom lash line. And you can apply a couple coats if you would like. Sometimes with this mascara I do, um, depending on how intense I want my eyelashes to be. Um, today I did not though, but you can definitely do that. I don't find any issues with this mascara really ever clumping. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Hey guys, so 
I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Um, I ended up going with, I don't think I showed, I don't think I told you the lip name, um, the Bella Pierre um, Kiss Proof Lip Cream. Um, I got this in a boxy charm, and I do want to talk about it in the video. Um, I do really like the color. I don't know if it's showing very well. It's really kind of more of a purple mauve color than I thought it would be. Um, in my viewfinder, it's not showing that color, so I hope it shows in the actual video maybe a little bit better. Um, as it is in person, it's more of a purpley mauve color. I really like the color of it actually um, more than I thought I would and maybe that's just the color it goes on to my lips because um, it's not the color that it shows in the tube or the, the swatch in my BoxyCharm video. Um, it did take though quite a few applications to be like a full coverage on my lip. My lip color was showing through. Maybe that's just something with my lip and the color of this. I don't know. Maybe that's why it's different on my lip than the actual swatch was on my hand. I'm not sure. Um, but I actually do really like the way that it dried. It's not sticky at all. Um, I don't really feel it on my lip. But I did want to let you know that I did have to do like a couple coats of it. Um, it's not like one coat and you're done. I did have to do, I think I did like three in total um, to really get it to cover my lip color. Um, but it is kind of almost close to your natural lip color as well, so that might be kind of why. But I do like the way, so we'll see how it wears throughout the day. I have This is the first time I've worn it, um, so this is kind of like a little first impression side note. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button if you did. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.